have a more full-bodied wine, a more alcoholic wine with more aroma, more uh, ripe. This is a little bit different in color. It's like uh, pale gold in color, golden rim. This is a little, sorry, water rim. So let's uh, throw the wine to check viscosity from the other two. Let's sip the wine. There's minerality to it. It looks like if you're drinking fast, there are a lot of, uh, not the oily type, but the ones that are uh, have a soft uh, meat. Some seafood will go very well. So now we're going to go to the red wines. And by the way, which is your favorite white wine? Number one, number two, or number three? All are some Bordeaux region, but now it's not the Antoine de Mer for this clay. Less gravel, very little gravel, but more clay. Which is perfect for Merlot, which is the base of the Merlot wines in the right bank of Bordeaux. The varietals in this wine are Cabernet Sauvignon, Merlot, Cabernet Franc, and Petit Verdot. So, usually the wines from Bordeaux are come in a blend. Why they come in a blend? Because the region completely well the Merlot to the Cabernet Sauvignon doesn't need to be two three years the wine this wine maybe is a wine that can age a lot so so let's have Mel yeah. that wine here the climate is very dry it's very hot but it's uh, usually at you fight wine is the uh, Sira from Castillo de Arezan Castillo de Arezan is a winery that is likes to go uh, it's a hundred Okay, so we have uh, the influence, usually uh, very nice uh, conditions for growing uh, grapes. The producer we're going to look at today is someone who revived a variety that was about to... Okay, I think they're going to make all the announcements in several languages, I hope not, because they cut my mic when that happens. So, this wine, is the producer is called Evangelo Gervasilio, like I told you, he was the one who uh, brought a variety called Malagusia from Extinction. He was uh, the student of Emile Peinot, a famous French enologist, and he learned to put the co-ferment with the um, Syrah variety. It makes it stabilize in color, so it doesn't... It's very, very shiny, very nice. The, the rim is no beautiful. Chocolate. The color is um, uh, a giveaway usually because Syrah gives a purple wine. It has some, uh, some purple, uh, a a oh, some purple color. Usually coming from the Syrah variety. Biomier in a small measure is uh, in the blend like 2 or 3 percent. So let's uh, swirl the wine to look for the viscosity. And you can see the legs forming a lot and I hope you like the wine tasting. Thank you very much. See you, See you later.